Hey everyone, it's Omi at Leftovers for Dinner, and welcome to an episode of Thrift Shop Thursday. Now, this episode of Thrift Shop Thursday, it's actually pretty short and sweet. I went to Thrift Shop looking for something specific, and I found it. And what I was looking for was leather belts. And it was amazing to see that there were so many nice, vintage, and just regular leather belts for a very decent price at the thrift shop. Now, I did pick up one that was a little messed up, but I picked it up because it's got this beautiful leather tooling. It's a little leaf and flower design, 99 cents, which is a great price for leather. I got this beautiful, I think this is a kid's or junior's belt, beautiful red leather belt. Again, some nice tooling, and some little rivets in there. Looks brand new. And the price tag fell off of this one. Paid $1.98 for this one, I think. Now, this one I am super proud of. I saw this one, turned it over, and as soon as I turned it over, I threw it in my basket all quick, almost like I was hiding something from other thrift shoppers. Now, if you look at it, it actually has some embroidery, some stud work on it. I turned it over, and I realized it was a... Oops, let's turn it the right way. Lucky Brand Jeans belt, and it's still got the little thingy on it. I got this for $3.98. Oh my god. Lucky Brand, it's got the official labeling on it. Nice leather, $3.98. And then I lift this up, and I noticed it said $65 for a Lucky Brand Jeans belt. I don't even know if I'm going to use this but I just had to get it because that's a great deal. Um, $4 versus $65, I'll do that all day. Now, the reason I got the leather belts is because I want to do a little craft project later on in the next couple weeks where I turn some thrift shop belts into really cool bracelets. I found these super ugly charm bracelet things. They're kind of broken got these, I did spend $1.98 on them, but if you look, they actually have some really cute charms on them. This one says hope and it's shaped like a flower. This one's a heart, like a little filigree heart. Now if I had gone to Michael's Arts and Crafts, I would have paid $1.98 to $3.98 for three little charms. Instead I have a bunch of them all over these bracelets. They do look like they were mistreated silver plated bracelets. Just more stuff to add to my craft crafting stash. A really awesome find. Let me go ahead and dig it all out for you guys. There is a little rummage bin at my local thrift shop and in it a little lace ribbon. Not sure if you guys can see that but yeah different colors. Got some purples, some peaches, Bunch of different types of white, some off-white and distressed white. And then I got these rolls. And if you look at the rolls inside of there, it says 75 cents. This one says 25 cents. This one's actually got velvet on it. So I brought all these stacks up to the counter and the dude ringing me up went five cents, five cents, five cents, five cents, five cents, five cents and so on. So that was really cool. I basically got a deal on top of a deal at the thrift shop. And I'm gonna love using this in some crafts. So super easy. Uh, all I have to do is put a button right there. But you know. Hmm. Now um, when I got to the counter they had just it looked like a beauty shop had closed down or something. So I got these peach gloves. I have no idea what I'm gonna do with them. They say four dollars on them. I got them for 25 cents. Maybe I'll put some more lace on them, accent them, put some stuff on them. Or these little hair barrettes also from I guess a closed down beauty store. And there you go. Now you have some kind of cool very bright colors for steampunk or cosplay or maybe even Lolita goth. These are little hair barrettes. Uh, got these, I want to say these were 25 cents each. But the cool thing about them is if I turn this Lucky Brand jeans belt into something, which I'm still not sure if I will or not, it matches perfectly. Basically got a lot of craft supplies at the thrift shop for almost no money at all. So before you set out to do a craft project that you see on Pinterest or you read a blog about, check your thrift shop first. You might save some money. 